Hey guys, it's Liv here. Bring you guys a Anything Goes Showdown Live today. We're literally bringing the six most broken Pokemon on the tier. Well, five most broken, or I should say three most broken, then Aveltal and Xerneas, because they were like next up. And then uh, and then Shadow Calyrex, because it, when it gets ranked, it will be up there. Um, as I promised, face cam because we hit the like goal on the last video. So shout out to that. We actually like almost doubled it. I was shocked. Um, I didn't think because it was like VGC and it wasn't like an official road to ranked that the episode would have done like that great. It did a bit better than I thought, but it got a lot more likes than I thought. So shout out to everyone. I guess doing like goals helps. Um, so here's what I'll do. Here's what I'll do. Um, if we, if we hit the like goal on, um, on today's video, the next anything goes showed on live that I do will, I will randomize my team for whatever, whatever six mons get hit on the randomizer. It could be like a baby Pokemon. It could be whatever. I will use them. So, uh, light goal will be 15 likes for this. Um, cause I think that'll be a lot harder and I actually have a good rating on anything goes for once we're entering a ladder where I'm like near 1600. Um, so yeah, like right here, for example, I'm literally 1598. Um, I, th this is after a lot of decay to be fair. Um, I was like 38th ranked at one point in the gen on this ladder. Um, I haven't played it a lot. I played it like earlier today to test this team in like three matches, but that's about it. I know a lot about the tier though. Um, to be fair, while some stuff has changed, not a lot has really changed because it's national decks. There are some new mons, not really anything too crazy. It's like a couple tutors and then like Calyx and maybe Reggie Lackey that matters, if anything, if anything. Um, but yeah, so as I said, 15 likes though, and I will randomize my team for the next one, um, including the sets. I will randomize the sets too. Uh, looking at this though, my guess is that Duskmane or Groudon are the lead. It depends. Um, there's definitely a Primal Groudon. There's no way it's regular. Um, really, really weird team to say the least. I think I'm going to lead off with, I think I'm going to lead off with Shadow Cali. Um, my opponent has no switch into this, zero switch ins, and I don't see Shadow Cali leading against us, though we at least have a switch in unlike my opponent. So I feel confident in that. Uh, we're going to also start timer, just so then I don't stall out the video as long as it can be. Okay, so Xerneas leads, perfect. So we're going to go for a... We're going to go for a trick, actually. This is where we trick. Oh shit, it Moonblast. Okay, well, that was kind of bad. That was actually really bad. Um, shit, okay. Good play by my opponent. I should have just Astral Barrage. My opponent had no switch-ins. Um, okay, well, not a huge deal. We just go for Behemoth Blade and my opponent sack. Okay, how low is this person? Okay, so this person's actually kind of high up. I would have anticipated that play from literally anyone else, but to be fair, it's a Spec Xerneas, so I mean, I guess. But Spec Xerneas still hits my team really well. Like, I now I, I know I have dual steel, but like, it still kind of destroyed my team. Um, we're gonna go hard into Ray. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And we're gonna go for a, we're gonna go for a Dragon Ascent. Just get some chip. My guess is this will edge. It went for Rock Polish. Okay, that's perfectly fine. I can just go for E-Speed this turn. Should do a decent chunk. And perfect. So we can even just finish this off. Shoutouts to Strong Winds. Um, I didn't want to set up a DD because of the fact that obviously Ditto is an issue. And Shadow Calyrex comes in. Okay, that's fine. I can just go hard into Veltal here. Yeah, even if this plots, um, I just go for Airstream this turn, to be honest. My opponent doesn't really have a great decision to this. Um, their switching would be their Ditto, which if they go into Ditto, it's fine. I can use that as a Xerneas fodder. So, yep, beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Um, and then from here, we just go for Darkness because there's zero reason not to. And I don't want to give this thing plus two either. So, we're going to go for another Darkness. If this is policy, it's fine. At least it's not going to go for like a Rock Polish or a DD because it would have to max to live. And even then we crit it. Hey, we'll take that. We'll take that. Let's go. Um, I think the crit probably mattered, but I don't know if it changed anything. Because the best policy popped and I went into like Ray and I V created it. So it didn't really change anything. It just more so sucked. Um, we're going to go for Oblivion Wing here. Get some HP back. I have zero clue why my opponent didn't just go Ditto. Um, definitely a throw in my opinion, but hey, we'll see. Um, this mod could have actually maybe been kind of useful if it was like Rock Polish, I guess. Okay, so there we go, sacked a Groudon, and then went- Why? What? Why? What was the point of that? What was the point of that? This person's really fucking dumb. This person's super dumb. Because even if they max, I don't even think they can, but even if they max, it's really not going to make a difference. Um, just in case, I'm going to go for Behemoth Blade on this. Okay, yeah, perfect. See that? Alright, my opponent really fucking choked there. They really shit the bed. Um, but yeah, no, you can literally win. I've gotten top ladder on AG several times just using best mods in the format. Um, you don't even need team synergy in my opinion. So yeah, uh, AG is a fun tier though. I still like it. Even though you don't need team synergy, it's a fun tier. Um, we're going to lead off with Zacian. I think Zacian is stupidly free here. I'm going to pause real quick though. 
Sorry about that. Had to help someone real quick. Um, Arceus Water Lead. Perfect. So the only thing that could be a switch into this on the entire team would be Arceus Ground. I'm gonna go for Wild Charge. Should do a fair bit. Perfect. And we avoid the attack. That kind of sucks, actually. That, that really sucks. Um, something I find odd, though, is that I know, like, to be fair, um, like, to be fair, I did end up making the timer kind of happen a bit. But, like, my opponent set timer after I chose my lead, but before they chose theirs. I thought it was really weird. Um, I don't know. We're gonna get rocks up. Oh, I really thought that the, I thought Arceus Water would have switched in. That would have been a good switch in. Okay, well, I'll go for knockoff, I guess, in case this stays in. Okay, there's the Arceus Water. Yep, and it's pretty obviously going to go for a recover here, which is truthfully fine. I can take its time to go into Shadow Cali. And we get a nice specs. I'm gonna go for, uh, I'm gonna go for an Astral Brush. Even if Titar comes in, that's fine. It's nice chip. Yeah, like, that's not bad chip on Titar. It's not like it's gonna have recovery of any kind. And we can just go into Dusk Vein. Because there's no fairy on the team unless it's an Arceus fairy. And Sunsteel is actually kind of free. Um, what I'm gonna actually do first is I'm gonna go for a knockoff in case of that. Um Okay, so Arceus came in. That that works too. I was thinking that maybe Dustman would come in trying to fish for uh fish for Sunsteel, but that also works. That was a good switch in. Um We're gonna go. I think we're gonna go into Xerneas here. Cause it's probably defog if I had to guess. We'll go for Geo this turn. Um, with Duskwain being chip, we can max and go for max fire. And perfect. Okay. So no did on this team means we get free max flare. Sun being up now as well means that we're definitely going to kill a Duskwain. Because with Sun up, I think we do 117 min to Duskwain, even if it's Spideff. I might be wrong in that. I know for a fact it's like a roll to kill without the Sun up. And Sun up is guaranteed. I just read the exact damage rolls. Um, okay, so this is going to max. That's fine too. Max guard. Okay. Really could care less. I'll go for another max flare, even if this thing, like, if this is the mod that they're burning the max on, it's fine. It's a defensive necrozma, it's not going to do anything. Okay, so they actually just wasted their time. They just threw the game doing that. Um, we'll go for a moon blast here, because it 100% kills. If my opponent just attacked, they, I think they could have actually had a chance to win. They just lost the game doing that, though, guaranteed. Oh, wow, what the fuck? This person's 1800s? Wow, that's going to be good for our rating. Holy shit. We will take that. 2-0 so far, just using dumb mons. Um, dumb mons with dumb sets. Uh, it just goes to show that anyone can learn this meta. Um, not that I think it's a hard, like a, not that I think it's an easy meta to play, because it's definitely a bit more, bit more, uh, mind gamey than, like, regular ubers, etc. But it's a meta that anyone can learn. Um, the fact that I did that with this team of no synergy should show that. There are, to be fair, some teams that have some phenomenal synergy, and I think that definitely plays in, but you don't need a good team to do it. You just, you can have a good team to do it. Um, I gotta think of a mod that I wanna put in the thumbnail for this. It's gonna be tough. It's gonna be tough. I think I'm gonna try and make a Veltal work. To be fair, none of these mods really work that well in thumbnails. I might do Mega Ray just to do it. Like, Mega Ray and Kali, I might just throw them in just to throw them in. I think it'd be kind of funny. Um, anyway, we're gonna, I think if it takes another, like, 10 seconds, I'm gonna pause. But we're gonna hope it doesn't take another 10 seconds. Um, I'm curious actually at our ladder rating. I'm curious. We'll check that real quick. Um, so let's see. We got to go to national decks. Um, oh, perfect. Okay. So we'll just check it right here. So we are currently 1615. Okay. So that definitely didn't update from last game because we would be a lot higher. We'd probably be like 1650 if I had to guess. Okay. So that Arceus form, but I had to guess it's probably steel. There's no way it's not steel. It's definitely peed on. Um, Xerneas is stupidly good here. I'm going to lead off with I think I'm gonna lead off with Cali because we at least have switch-ins if they lead off with either of the ghosts. I'm still curious though of the national decks ladder. National decks, here we go. National decks AG. Where do we sit? Where do we sit on the national decks AG ladder? Um, Lugia leads. Okay, perfect. We get a free Astral Barrage out of this. Beautiful. I don't even care that we got Toxic. My opponent has one switch in and it's a Veltal. Um, let's see, let's see. I can control F. Um, zero. Via some. Uh, um. We don't actually, damn, we're not even on here. What? We should definitely be on here. Um, maybe it's not letting us control F. So the 16, 15 will be around where we should have been. So we're definitely higher than that. I'm kind of curious. Where do we sit? Where do we sit on the ladder? Because we're definitely higher than that. Um, oh, here we go. We're 149. Nice. 12, 1647. Beautiful. Okay. So we killed the ground and we actually, you just let us kill the ground and that's fine. Um, we're gonna go hard into Zacian Crown. If this thing goes for anything but Airstream, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay. So now what I can do is I can just go for Behemoth Blade. Okay, so that is an Arceus Ground, and it's not gonna outpace us. Yeah, this is free. My opponent's acting peed on there was so huge for us. Because it basically just lets us run wild with this. 
Oh, when a Veltal, when Marshall comes in, I'm going hard to Veltal because it's going to have to Spectral Thief. No reason it wouldn't. Um, it's definitely a Sash Marshall as well because they didn't just try and aggressively go into it. Um, if they did go grow aggressively into it, I would know it's Scarfed. But, uh, but yeah, so we'll see what happens. My guess is though, it's definitely Spectral Thief into Sneak, if I had to guess. Um, maybe Endeavor too. It could go for Endeavor into Sneak. That also would work because it is Sash for sure. Um, hmm. So let's see. So yeah, Marshad is definitely going to click Thief or Endeavor. So I think Veltal still is our best play, 100%. Veltal is also really stupid in this meta. Um, just max airstream plus darkness with dark aura. It's super dumb. In my opinion, I'm shocked that Veltal is not an S rank Pokemon. It really should have been. Like if we pull up, I'll actually pull this up real quick because I think it's kind of interesting. Um, let's see. Can I just scroll up? No, I can't. Okay. So tier national dex AG. And then we can pull up the viability rankings. So you'll see Aveltal is still high up here to be fair. Like it's A+. Plus, but like Aveltal definitely in my opinion is better than the S rank Pokemon. Just my personal opinion. Um... Ooh, Z Marsh Shadow. I actually haven't seen that in a while. That's kind of fire. Um, okay, so we literally just airstream though and we win. We we 100% win doing this because it's not a Sash Marsh Shadow, so it can't even like steal our speed boost. Yep, and literally the only thing my opponent could do to stop this is if that's a Scarf Calyrex, and it is not. And even then, it would have to like Scarf Calyrex go for Draining Kiss and probably crit us. So we just go for airstream here. And that's dead. Lugia's definitely gonna die to next hit. A Veltal. Veltal could actually probably take a hit, but it's not going to get past their team. Like, a Veltal can't 1v6 us. Um, we could probably have unironically 1v6 their team with a the Veltal. They couldn't do that to us, though, just because their team comp. So, Max, that's fine. We're going to outpace, and we're going to get a ton of HP back from this. Um, that crit's going to basically, yeah, get us to full. Okay. So, that is perfectly fine. Um, we just go into Zacian here. It's definitely going to go for Heat Wave, but I, like, Max Flare, but I really don't mind. As long as this thing isn't getting more, um, as long as this thing isn't getting other boosts. We outpaced it anyway. Okay, so it was Modest. Um, beautiful. Okay, so yeah, we win the game. I'm just gonna click Wild Charge just because I can. And perfect. Uh, but yeah, I think, I think I'm 100% surprised that we don't see, um, that we don't see, whatchamacallit, Zos, uh, Veltal in S rank. I think it's better than Duskmane personally. Um, maybe that's an unpopular opinion, but I do think that nonetheless. Ladder hasn't updated yet. That's fine. Um, okay. So we're currently 3-0 for this live. Um, I will be linking this team down below, by the way. I think it's a super free team. Uh, I've done this, like, every gen. Well, not in a video every gen. I did it for Pedon in, uh, I did it for Gen 6 with, uh, Pedon, Kyogre, uh, Pedon, on uh, Primal Kyogre, Mega Ray, um, Darkrai, Z uh, Xerneas, and Arceus Normal, E-Killer. Um, uh, because that was before Marshadow. That was when Dark Void wasn't nerfed. So that was, like, my big 16 then. Uh, then in Gen 7, I just changed out Darkrai for Klefki, which then I changed out for Solgaleo. Like, right before Duskmane came out, and then I changed it out for Duskmane, which inevitably then fixed that team and made it an actual big six team. Um, Klefki I just threw on there just to pull bullshit. Um, and then Duskmane I threw on there. Alright, so Galia I threw on there because I got swept by Arceus Ice plus Xerneas plus Magirna. Um, then I threw Duskmane on there because it's just better. Um, but it was like a spec series, so he was super weird. Um, it was a good set, but it was just super weird for the meta at the time. Um, and then now we have this team. Now we have this team. I threw another team earlier the gen. Okay, so this is some low ladder person. It's probably like, okay, yeah, 1300. I was actually thinking it was like 1200. Okay, forfeit. That's fine. Um, but yeah. Uh, earlier in the gen, I used a team. I used a couple teams. I wonder if I have them still. Nash National Dex AG. I do have it. This actually isn't the team I was thinking of. Um, this is another team, but it is still cool nonetheless. Um, I have a lot of AG. Well, I had a lot of AG teams. I lost it. Um, I had one. Do they actually have it still? National Dex AG teams. I wonder if it's still here. The Veltal team is not here. Okay. Damn, it was a really fun team. That had a Veltal team. That was super fun. Um, damn. Okay. Oh, well. Not a huge deal. It was a really fun team. I kind of wish I had it still. Not a big deal, though. Um, so yeah, I'm going to pause real quick while we try and find a game because it seems like the ladder's kind of slow right now. So I actually did find the team. Um, I'll actually go over it in a bit after. But, um, but yeah, so it was basically this. Um, the one thing that I did have different, um, was I changed out Taunt for Hidden Power Rock. I saw that as an alternative on the spread and I liked it more. Um, but otherwise, this was the team. It was a super fun team. Scarf Mega Ray actually was super dumb, and it caught so many people off guard. Especially when they DD'd with their adamant Mega Rays. It was super, super fun. Um, but looking at this, though, we have a Mono Dark plus Corviknight team. Don't know why. Regardless, though, we're going to lead off with Zacian. Kind of just destroys. Okay. So this isn't like some sort of, uh, this isn't some sort of level one bullshit set. Okay. Thought it was going to go for Swagger. It's going for Confuser. Why isn't it going for Swagger? What? Why not Swagger? It's objectively just better because it would be harder, much harder damage. 
Um, that's super weird. Okay, well, we're gonna go for SD here. Like, I know that's kind of dumb with the confusion up. Okay, so we're actually just gonna wild charge here because if we, like, we're gonna die anyway. Okay, that's fine. Um, we can go for V create this turn. So beautiful. Okay. Uh, yeah, we have V create and then we just start dragging and something, everything else. Um, Houndoom comes in. Oh no, Houndoom comes in. The mod that's gonna totally, actually, that kind of, kind of does a lot. I'm not gonna lie. Um, we're gonna go for DD though. Um, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, perfect. We'll go for V create this turn. Even if Houndoom comes in now, it can't outpace us. I think my opponent just lost. Um, yeah, I think my opponent just lost. Yep. Okay, so they actually maxed Inferior of Eltal. Don't know why. How low was this? 15? What the fuck? Why? Why? Okay, let's see how high we are in the ladder, because I'm kind of curious. We'll, we'll look for a game, because we've had bad at looking for game luck. So look for a game while we try and find our ladder reading. Um, oh, okay, perfect. We are 1662. We're probably higher than that. Okay. Um, probably Arceus, probably Arceus Ground, and probably Barry, I want to guess? Maybe Normal? Probably Water, actually. Probably Water. Probably Water and Ground, if I had to guess. Um, maybe not, though. Um, oh, you know what? This is the Garth. Okay, yeah. So it was, it was Water and something else. Okay, okay. So we're going to lead off with, we're going to lead off with Zacian. Zacian's super free. We're going to, I'm going to go for an S, no, no, because it says, this is Willow. This is Willow. This is Willow. Um, we'll go hard into Xerneas, to be honest. And I'm just gonna go for, I'm not even gonna set up, I'm just gonna click Moonblast, just for the chip. Um, Duskmane's gonna obviously come in. Actually, you know what, I'm gonna double into Veltal on that. We're gonna go for Max of Veltal this time. Bye bye. Beautiful. And then from here, we can go for a Max Flare, this will get rid of some Spadef as well, which will be phenomenal on Titar. That would've really helped Titar out, huh? So we're gonna go for that. And then now what I can do is I can go for a Darkness. <laughs> And between the Spadef being gone and the Spadef drop, yeah, the T-Tar just drops. Beautiful. We didn't even need the speed boost on this, to be completely honest. Because we just kind of chipped the whole team anyway. Um, okay, so assurance. Oh no, that actually kind of, ugh, that did a lot. Okay, not a huge shield, not a huge shield. We have Specs Cali. And the best part is, my opponent has zero, count it, zero switch into this mod now. So this will be fun. Um, every time that Cali comes in, I have a good switch in in a Veltal. Or maybe not a switch in. Okay, so they're really just throwing the game, huh? Okay, well, my opponent threw. That's fine. Um, there Cali comes in. Okay. Um, I think I just go for Astro Barrage and yep, we win the speed tag. That's what we had to bank on, basically. Um, because the Veltal was a bit too low and it didn't have Sucker Punch because we're offensive. Because this is AG and we're not cowards about that. We are in Ubers, but we're not in AG. We're not in AG. AG, we just say fuck it. Um, we're probably hitting near 1700s now. Um, a living sum. 101. So we're super close. We're super close. Um, that game that we just had will probably put us a bit higher. That'll probably put us in the top 100. Um, let's see real quick, I guess, if it refreshed. We'll hit refresh real quick and see. Do we break 100? Still isn't refreshed yet. God damn it. Okay. Not a huge shield. Not a huge shield. Um, we'll probably hit around like here if I had to guess. Um, goal is going to be 1700 today. I think 1700 is a super duper good goal. Um, we'll keep refreshing until we find a game, to be honest. Oh, look, we got higher. We got higher. Um, where are we now? Oh, shit, we're 78. We're 1,700 on the dot. Let's go. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. That just goes to show, like, we are, we are around, like, 1,598. Where does 1,598 put us on the ladder? 1,598. So that puts us... 1,598 would have put us around, like, the low 200s. So it just goes to show how using dumb mons can work. Uh, G-Max Lappers, for sure. Uh... Okay, okay, this is definitely a fail team. Fuck, that could actually be kind of annoying. We're gonna lay off a Zacian. Beautiful. Okay, you know what? This works, this works. Um, what we're gonna do here is we're gonna go for a close combat. This is definitely gonna max, and even if it didn't for some reason, we were fine. Uh, from here, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go for, we're gonna go for another CC. Cause this doesn't switch in exactly, or like switch out exactly, beautiful. So we've at least cleared the max mon. We only have to worry about like a few more turns of fail. Peed on it. Ooh, fuck. Okay. We're gonna go into... I think we're gonna go into Ray. Ray's kind of dumb this match. Like, we don't really need it. We'll go for E-Speed. I'm for uh, Dragon Ascent. We have Void. Okay, that's actually kind of good. Um, We'll go for Dragon Knights here. Just try and get the attack. There we go. And then perfect. So, that was nice. That was actually super nice. So, two more turns of Veil left. Um, What I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna go for an Airstream. No, no, no. I'm going to go for just an Oblivion Wing here. Or Dark Pulse. Yeah, I'm just going to go for Dark Pulse. I don't want to max yet. I want Veil to be gone before I max. Um, but it's good to have. Good to have. Okay, so we're going to go into Duskman here. 
And we're going to go for Steel Spike. Because we can still definitely dent this even without... Um, okay, so my opponent actually didn't max... Oh, right, they maxed the Lapras. Okay, so that was... Yeah, okay, that was definitely our best play. This is low ladder. Okay, makes a lot more sense. Um, We'll just go hard into Zacian here. We don't even need to, like, do anything at this point. We can sack Zacian. Sucker Punch, that's fine. We go into Xerneas. And then we Geo, and then we win, unless it's on Arceus Steel. But I don't think it's Arceus Steel. It could actually be. Actually, that wouldn't be the worst spring in this team. That actually would be kind of good. Okay, well, we Moonblast, and that's game. Literally, the only counterplay, I guess, would be Arceus Steel, but it can't even switch in because it has to take Chip. Um, It has to avoid taking Chip. It's Arceus Normal anyway. It's E-Killer. Okay, that's actually not bad. Um, That's fine. We're going to go for Spec Psy Shock. Um, I don't even care if this kills or not. It's just going to do nice Chip. Is that Headbutt? Okay, so this doesn't even have Shadow Claw. Okay, and then we do this, and then we slash off just for chip. That's fine. Doesn't kill us, and we go for Dark Pulse, and we win. Beautiful. Okay, so we'll get one more game. Um, we'll get one more game, even if this is only like a quick game, unless it's under 20. It would need to be like under four minutes. Um, but yeah, no, this team is super good. Super, super free team. Um, let's see. So we'll, perfect. Okay, I was just about to pause. Um, this looks like a mono fire team, so I guess this fire Arceus. Um, probably max Cinderace. Um, maybe could just max Ho, to be completely honest. Um, super, super weird teams. Why are we even fighting so much monotype? And why is this person high in the ladder? Um, okay, so we're gonna lead off with Calyrex. My opponent has zero switch, and the only lead they could have that would actually scare me would be Cinderace leading. We have a counterplay to that. Perfect. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna go for a max Mindstorm. Because truthfully, I want to make sure that we can't get Sucker Punched. I care about that much more than having our specs, to be honest. And this is a nice boost for Psychic anyway. I care about that much more than not getting, uh, not getting fucking Mac Sucker Punched. Okay, perfect. So we're going to go for another Mind Storm here. Um, okay, so this one for Max Guard. That's fine. We're going to go for Psy Shock. It's going to probably hit, like, as hard. Ooh, okay, not bad, not bad. It was a good play. We can go for Rock Slide, though. Um, my opponent definitely can't kill us. There's zero chance that they kill us. Yep, I'm perfect. This will definitely kill my opponent. Because it's Rock Slide. Oh shit, that didn't kill. Ooh, okay. Um, could be kind of an issue. Could definitely be kind of an issue. Um, but it's fine, it's fine. I don't think we're like screwed. Um, definitely Mega Blaziken. Uh oh, maxed at least, so that's good. We don't need to worry about like figuring out the maximum. Um, Zacian can still truthfully tear. Um, we need to Oblivion Wing this turn. Um, if my opponent has an SD, that's fine. That's actually great for us. Protect. Okay. That's fine. Um, kind of expected, to be honest. We just go into Ray next. It's Protect, Low Kick. It's probably got Edge, but I kind of need to bang on the miss. Um, we can go for Ascent, though. Guaranteed. It's super, super free. Um, let's see. Yeah, we're just going to go for Ascent here. Beautiful. Stone Edge. Yep. Doesn't do much. Okay. So, yeah. Uh, Zacian should be able to win at this point. My opponent can't really boost their speed in any way, so Zacian's going to kind of just dent shit. Um, my guess is that Arceus comes in if it's Arceus Fire and it goes for Ice Beam, if I had to guess. Um, which is fine. If Arceus Fire comes in, we can actually just use that next to set up on. Um, we'll go for a set just in case it's slower. That's fine. That's not. We Geo here. Heatran will still take a ton from a Thunder anyway. Like, I know there's a Heatran there, but we kind of just need a Geo. Um, okay. So we go for a, hmm. Let's see. So this is a Resist, but it's also a Stab. I'm going to go for a Thunder here. Just maybe try and fish for a para. Or a crit. If we crit, then I think we win. Crit. All right, para. Okay, you know what? We'll take that. Thunder. Ooh, okay. We're gonna go for thunders. Um, We'll go for Moonblast now. Just because I don't want to miss and we're not doing good damage anyway. We can hope for a crit. We're actually... We can also fish for special attack drops, to be fair. Uh, but my opponent being Judgment Fire and Ice Beam. Ooh, that hits us really well. Shit, that hits us super well. We're gonna go for thunder and hope we can crit. Can we crit? Can we crit? Can we just full para at least? Can we crit or full para? Darn. Crit or full para? Crit or full para? Da damn it. Come on. Crit or full para? <laughs> I just want a crit or full para. God damn it. Come on. Crit or full para? Beautiful. 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 Damn it. So close. Crit or full para? Damn it. Stop dodging. Crit or full para? Can we crit or full para? Can we crit here? I think we should deserve a crit. Damn it. Okay. We're going to crit here. We're gonna, we're gonna at least special attack drop until, but we're gonna crit. Come on, can we crit here? Damn it, okay. Well, we're gonna crit with close combat anyway, so it's fine. 
Um, yeah, we're in a close combat here. I think that does the most. Damn it. Okay, we lose. Damn it. Let's be full power here. Um, yep. No, so close. Okay. Well, um, we'll try and get one more game. I don't want to end on a loss, and I think we can still bounce back. I play that one really shit, to be honest. Um, but it's fine. It's fine. They're not always going to be some great matchups. So it is what it is. Um, let's check our rating real quick, because we definitely went down a bit. To be fair, we also went up a bit. Um, yeah, we're probably... We're probably at like the, still the 100 range, but I do want to win again. We're going to win one more game and then we'll be good. Um, okay. Beautiful. So we're fighting guard sweeper for a third time this live. Holy shit. This guy must be sick of us. Um, wow. This guy's ladder rating is really tanked. He's almost where we are. Um, okay. 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 Wonder if he changed up his team because he kept on losing to us. Um, we're going to lead off with, we're going to lead off with Cali. There we go, beautiful. So I'm gonna go for a max Mindstorm here. Um, if that's a Sash Marshal, that's fine. I do wanna go for the Mindstorm though, because we can get up terrain and we can avoid priority that way. Arceus Dark, ooh, fuck. We can go for Starfall on this at least. Um, that should still do a substantial amount to be fair. Um, and I would assume that we can live a hit. I know that it's like four times, but we're also max. So anything is possible. Judgment, damn it, okay, not a huge shield. Um, when Khan was probably Zacian anyway this game, to be honest. Um, Duskmane. Okay. That's fine. We'll go for an SD here. We can't get Thunder Waved at least. Um, and I'm gonna go for one more SD. And then we can go for ACC. When Marshadow comes in. Okay. That, that was a good play. That was a really good play. Um, we'll go for Oblivion Wing. I should have probably saved the max for this to be fair, but eh. Oh well. Um, we can go for Rockside this turn. Should destroy the ho- Oh, beautiful. Okay. So now Velta kind of tears at least, which is good. Um, Mega Ray, that's fine. We go into... I'm gonna go for Oblivion Wing in case it's DDs. I don't want this thing DDing. Okay. Decreate, perfect. Because now, I can go into Serenity Sun, I just click Moon Blast. I don't even risk, because it could obviously do a ton with DD into E-Speed. So I'm not even gonna risk that. Um, we'll go... Let's see, this is definitely Helmet. We'll go and go into Zossi and we can sack that. Oh, and it doesn't. Even better. Perfect. We can go for CC and just kill ourselves off. This is definitely gonna go for Sunsteel here. Um, okay, beautiful. It goes for Moonlight. Good play, good play. We'll go for Knock Off this turn, because I do I do think a Ray actually has a good chance at winning this. Um, okay. So we knock off. We're gonna go for Rocks just in case that's a Sash Marshadow for some reason. I don't think it is, but in case it is, we'll go for Sunsteel here. In case my opponent goes for like a, a recover. Whirlpool. Ooh. So it goes for recover now. Alright. Um, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go into, so it's Whirlpool, Judgment, Recover. I'm going to go into, I'm going to go into Xerneas here. Then I'm going to Geomancy on this. Okay, that's fine. We can go for Moonblast. Not like my opponent can switch. Um, and yep, Duskmane is the best play. All right. Hidden Power 5 should still do a substantial amount. That did nothing. Wow. Fatmon, Fatmon. Um, we're going to go for Knockoff here. My opponent at least can't really touch us, to be fair. Well, actually, Darkness, shit, that'll do a lot. We're gonna Sunsteal. Right, not Sunsteal, um, Morning Sun. Okay. Um, we'll go for Knock Off. Band is gone. Beautiful. Okay. If we kill this, I think we can still maybe win. But I don't know. It's gonna be rough. Um, even if we lose, this will be the last game we do. Because I can't really, can't really afford to lose Diff. Um, we're gonna go for a DD here. I'm just gonna hope that we can live. Beautiful. We're gonna go for a scent. I think we can still maybe win this actually. Um oh right, we're life up shit. Okay, never mind. Yep, that's game. Alright, well, that's gonna be it for the live. Um, we went like four or five and two, something like that. Point is that was only lost twice, so I'll take that. Uh team will be down below for anyone who wants it. If you guys did enjoy, leave a like down below. Subscribe if you're new, comment below your thoughts on what you want to see next. 15 likes, and we're gonna randomize our team next time. With that said, I will see you guys later. Peace out, guys.